Hello and a warm welcome to everyone across the globe. We should be on the way very shortly. The players will be with us any time now. Well, I'm Peter Drury and I'm joined in the commentary box by the familiar figure of Jim Beglin. Well, thank you very much, Mr Drury, and hello to everyone. So it's down to business here. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? I'm going to go for the experienced Igor Akinfeyev. He's always been an agile stopper, but having been on the scene from, from such a young age, he's a much calmer decision maker these days. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. Cochrane, aimed long and direct. Looks to slip it through. Can he find a finish now? And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Oh, great ball! It's a loose ball. Oh, this has proven to be a really bright start, but they can improve on their work in and around the opposition's box if they want to turn it into something more beneficial. This is promising. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Shapes the shoots. Oh, great save. Real class. Oh, much more than a, than a routine save for me, and, and yet he just coped with, with room to spare. Passes it through. Now here's the through ball. And the header! Oh, just needed a better contact. Well, you can't fault his movement and the way he worked the chance, but maybe he lost a bit of accuracy in trying to put too much power into the header then. Tries a through ball. A chance! Turns and goes back. Uh, needed a better pass there. Nicely controlled. It's Neustetter! Good stop. That wasn't easy. Well, I can only add that he's got reflexes that are in perfect working order, Peter. That was very good to watch. towards the front. Samadov. Russia get it back again. A 
This is quite a run, and he's not done yet. Well, offside that time. Ooh, that was marginal. I'd say very marginal. Good idea, just poorly executed. Samadov huckling down that right flank. Now the pass. Looks like a good ball through. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. Keeper ended up a spectator there. He was wrong footed and stranded, and uh, for me, I think he was left praying. Cochrane. Time getting close now. Is there any support? He might not need it. Oh, the ball's come loose. He's missed, but not by that far. Well, if he hopes to do better than that, he's got to work on his technique and his timing. The contact wasn't right there, so there wasn't much chance of success. Oh, he really wanted that. It's tremendous play on his part, Peter, and he's proving to be a, a right handful throughout the game. Neustetter gathers from the goal kick. And the through ball is intercepted. Aimed forward. Oh, he's broken through. Pumps it upfield. Well positioned to make that interception. Shapes the shoots. First 45 minutes are up. The midway point of the game. Russia ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment. That has to be maintained in the second half. And after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change perhaps after half time. Away again. Russia can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. The chance! Oh, Fence got the better of him this time, but I'm sure he'll go again. Yeah, it wouldn't have been the most eye catching goal we'd seen. Ultimately, the numbers prevented him from scrambling it in. Kokorin. Has a hit! Oh, what a hit! What a hit! Oh, that is a gem! And that is the goal we've all been yearning for. One sweeping move executed with deadly efficiency. Just when they thought they may be in at one end, they end up shipping a goal at the other, and it's all due to wonderful counter-attacking. They hardly had time to even react. There's only one word to describe that. Clinical. Checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. Russia get themselves into the lead. Oh, half time has been a blessing for this team. You know, what a great start to the second half. Yeah, he's pulled him up for that challenge. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Just the talking to, I think. Yes, it is.
Yeah, and it's a good opportunity to level it, and they have several in this team who can who can take this. It certainly looks appetising, well within shooting range. He's gone for it! Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Oh, he couldn't have hit that any better. Any other time it would have sneaked in. Piece of really good defending. Ignashevich hoops it upfield. Can he score? And the ball's come out. Samadov tries the route one option. Forward it goes. Now here's the through ball. Looking to shoot. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Whistle's gone, that's a foul. Ignashevich. Steered out wide. Now here's the through ball. It's a brilliant interception. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. run through the middle but he needs support he's off on a marauding run they scored early in the second half to make it 1-0 he's had a go that is wayward look they haven't had that many shooting opportunities against this defense but along with some patience now they need to find a bit more invention and craft Ignashevich Play for a throw. Balls out on the left now. That's a good block, but at the expense of a corner. Chase it out of harm's way. And the finish! Oh, and that should have been two. Oh, it should have been the clincher, Peter, and he'll be kicking himself for not taking the pressure off. He put on quite a show there. Well, in all honesty, he's tormented that defence. They just can't handle him. Looking to force his way through. World class from Cochrane! A two-goal cushion, and it's looking safe! Kokorin with the smoothest one-on-one -on -one finish. He is one very cool customer. Yeah, he always had the measure of the keeper and there was very little doubt as to how this was going to end up. His second of the game and an eye now for the hat-trick. Russia could not have picked a better time to snatch a two-goal lead. Is there still time for a response? Brings it forward. He's away! Big chance! One-on-one! -on -one. They are rampant! 
Surely now, beyond all doubt. Well, none of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a, a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did fool that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. Russia take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. Into a minimum of four minutes additional time. Who's going to make this theirs? Glushikov passes it through. They've managed to get it away. And that is that. Demolition, destruction, annihilation. They simply ran away with it. Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? It's a very good win, and as a former defender, I know they'll be very happy in the back not to have conceded. Yes, you're part of a team, but as a unit that works together, you have a, an added pride in, in a job well done. Many thanks to Jim, and with that, it is a very good night to you.